tired. The woman I married is a good woman. She the best thing ever happened to me. She's God-fearing. She's loyal. She's faithful. And she's a kind and loving person. I don't care what nobody says. And y'all quit talking about she was in my other marriage and ruined it. She didn't. She was nowhere around that. My marriage, I got divorced in 2005. My marriage was over when the Kings of Comedy was out. Y'all ain't know that though, did you? It was over then. It wasn't worth a quarter then. It took us this long to get to the divorce. That's when the, that's when the uh, official paperwork came out. But in 2005, let me help you to something. I had nothing. I lost the radio show we were on in L.A. on March 23rd, and I lost the only TV show I had May 10th. I mean, May 20, May 23rd, I lost the radio show, and May 10th, I lost the TV show. Steve Harvey had no money. Got with Marjorie again on uh, New Year's Eve, met her, talked to her. She was with her kids in Hawaii. We got together in 2006. We had nothing. She didn't, she didn't, she didn't marry into no lap of riches. I had nothing. When I asked her to marry me at the end of 2006, and, I, and then she, she said she wanted to get married in 2007, I sold it too soon. I, I got to get some stuff together. She said, what? I said, baby, I ain't really got nothing. I'm trying to build. She said, I'm going to get in there and build with you. We got married in 2007. Do you know what I was doing in 2007? Nothing. We had four. We had four stations in 2005. Four. We built this. All of us built this. We had four stations. We turned this into something. But that woman got down in that foxhole with me and turned this into something. In 2007, we got married. In 2008, we found out that somebody had stolen seven years of my tax returns. I ain't going to mention no name. And we owed the government $22 million and we in debt. But then guess what? She stayed with me in that. Then guess what? In 2009, I got Family Feud. In 2009, the book came out. In 2012, the talk show came out. I'm telling you, this woman got in the hole and built this with me. She didn't steal nothing. And I'm tired of y'all talking about my girl. Because my girl is one of the best women I've ever met. And why you black ass people out there got these blogs like you just going to destroy somebody? I don't really know what that's about. But don't worry about it because it ain't working. Because all we are now, we are a tighter two-handed circle. Thank you for doing that. And you're not going to split us up. And we're not going nowhere. And she is none of what you said she is. And she the best chick I know. Now I'm defending her.